Okay, so I want to record a little video here about Game of Thrones. Um, <clears throat> I um, the sixth series of which starts um, this weekend, starts on Sunday night. Um, uh, so, and it's a series I really enjoy. Um, I've been I've watched it since the you know I've watched the whole all of it since it began uh, five or six years ago, and um, five years ago, and um, and really enjoyed it. You know, um, I I first heard of uh, Game of Thrones. Uh, um, you know, Game of Thrones is the name of the TV show. The the the, the series of books on which, on which it's based is, uh, is 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 correctly called the um, you know the song or saga of fire and ice. The song of fire and ice, or a song of fire and ice, is what the the collection of books are known as. But the, and the first book is called Game of Thrones. Um, but anyway, the TV people went with the Game Game of Thrones name, and uh, and that's that's really what it's universally known as now. Um, but I first heard of Game of Thrones because a friend of mine, uh, who's an actor, was up for a part in it, and um, I um, I um, you know he told me he was up for it, and you know it sounded like it was a big deal and so on, and I hadn't heard of it at the time, and nor had he, but. When I uh, went and checked it out, and you know, with a name like Game of Thrones, I thought, "Whoa, man, it's going to be something like the Tudors or something," you know. But um, when I checked it out, uh, anyway, I found the, some of the first series online, and I looked at a couple of episodes, and I was hooked. I mean, I just thought it was fantastic. It was really, really well done, and you know, the scripts were great, the story was strong, and the, the acting was terrific, and. Um, and the characters were, it was just, it was just a perfect, it was, for me, it was just a perfect uh, t television, you know, and, um, and I really enjoyed it, and I watched the whole of the, I binge watched the whole of the first uh, series, and, um, and then I couldn't wait for the second series to come out, you know, um, and you know that the uh, Game of Thrones is, is, is made in Ireland, is made in Northern Ireland, um, you know, and the, like the, the all the scenes in the north of Westeros are shot in Northern Ireland. Westeros is the is the fictional um, kingdom at the heart of the story, right? And um, you know, the, all the scenes in the north uh, are um, filmed in Northern Ireland, right? And all the scenes north of the wall, um, there's a wall at the top of Westeros, um, you know, a, a wall of ice that separates. Um, uh, you know the seven kingdoms from the from the outer world. You know from the from the from the um, Northlands, from the you know the wild Northlands, um, and all all the scenes above the ice wall are filmed in Iceland, and uh, and then all the scenes in the south of Westeros are, are filmed in, in you know places like Spain and uh, Croatia and so on like that. But um, but the the whole thing is kind of centered. In in Northern Ireland, you know that's where the headquarters are, and that's where the the two showrunners, um, D David Benioff and 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 uh, David uh, Weiss of Weiss, are um are are are, are centered in Northern Ireland, you know, and they spend about six months of every year there. I saw a show, I saw a film on YouTube about the making of Game of Thrones, and um they they say they were saying that you know that. Uh, Northern Ireland is not really, you know, not much to do there, you know, for them, and uh, uh, and um, and they said that was a good thing because it meant that when they're there, they get a little work done, you know. Anyway, um, so uh, my friend did not get the part in the in the that he was up for, um, but anyway, because it's being made in Ireland, there's just lots of opportunities for Irish actors, you know. There's always little small bits coming up, and um, yeah, I think. Um, anyway, the second series, yeah, so then I watched the second series when it came out, and then I was so hungry for more at the end of the second series, I uh, went out and bought the books, and um, I, uh, you know, because I wanted more, you know, I, I wasn't going to go back and read book one and two, because I'd just seen the series, uh, series one and two, uh, so I just started on with number three, and just read all the way through, and you know, the book series, like this, um, there's seven books in the in the in the series, uh, five of which are published, but um, you know, for example, book three 
is actually made up of two books, right? These are huge books, like they're eight or nine hundred pages, right? And book three is actually in two volumes, and uh, each volume is about seven hundred pages, right? So that they're enormous books, you know, but they're fantastic, and they're you know they really they really move along, and it's it's just pure entertainment. It's fantastically well done, and um. So I read my way through, and then book five is also in two volumes, so that, you know, I read from book three, book four, book five, which was actually like, uh, what's that, five volumes. Um, and, um, and you know, um, and then, you know, everybody's waiting for uh, George Martin, George R. R. Martin, who's the author of the books, uh, to get on and produce book number six, you know. Um, but he's uh, he's kind of got himself caught up in the whole thing with the TV with the TV series, you know. And um, you know the thing about this is that the books, you know, they take longer. The books take longer and longer to produce. You know, the first book was out in ninety six. The second book was out in uh, you know I think ninety eight or two thousand or something. And then the third book was out in two thousand and two or something. And then the next book was anyway. The next book took five years. The next book took six years. And book six. Um, it's already taken like um, I don't know. It hadn't appeared yet, and you know it's taking longer and longer to produce each book in the series. And the, you know, the great fear is that Martin, that George Martin, is going to die before the before he finishes the damn series, because he's like sixty eight or seventy. He's, he's I think he's nearly seventy years old. So. Um, and clearly himself, he himself is is, a, is worried about this because, as I say, he's got caught up in the making of the TV series, which has just been a huge global success, and um, um, and you know he's got caught up. He's been involved in script writing some of the episodes and uh, storyboarding some of it, and he's a kind of an executive co co executive producer or something like that. And um, you know he goes on all these. Uh, he's on chat shows and he goes to all these premieres. And you know he's got. And I'm sure he's having the time of his life. But uh, you know he needs to get back and be and get on with being a writer because that's the that's the main thing. You know. Um, the final thing I want to say is um, about you know the, uh, the years ago I read a book called um, uh, Writing the Blockbuster Novel by Al Zuckerman, and. Um, and uh, and at the time I was interested in writing a blockbuster novel, you know, and um, the, this the, the Zuckerman's book is is a really good book, and uh, um, in it, you know, he kind of says that you know if you want to write a block, you know, blockbusters have got certain key things. Uh, all blockbusters have got certain key things, you know, um, and uh, and he lists the, the the key characteristics that they have, and then he discusses these characteristics with reference to. A handful of blockbusters, right? And the blockbusters that he he uses as his examples are, like The Godfather and uh, Gone with the Wind and The Thornbirds and a Ken Follett novel, right? Zuckerman used to be um, Ken Follett's agent, right? So, and and he's been the agent for a couple of other ma kind of you know major entertainment writers as well. So. Um, so the, the the key the key characteristics are you know the, an exotic sort of landscape right um you know you know it's got to be a landscape that you know people generally would wouldn't uh, an exotic uh, world that people wouldn't ordinarily get access to right so the world of high finance or the world of politics or the medieval court or uh, you know elite sports or you know the world of you know New York gangsters or you know the world of drug barons, or the world. You know what I mean. So the, uh, you know, so it's an exotic world, the world that you, uh, the book allows you to have access to it, and you wouldn't normally have access to such a world, right? You know, maybe it's set in the church, or you know, the cardinals, or you know, that sort of thing, or as a, you know, so how maybe set in Hollywood with movie moguls or something like that. So exotic location. The stakes in a, in a blockbuster novel must be high, right? And uh, you know you've got to the person's life has got to be in danger, and you know he's trying to he or she or hero, um, you know he's trying to if he fails in his mission, then you know a whole community of people are going to fail, right? So that you know that you know so the whole families and the whole uh, communities and the whole nations. The, the fate of whole nations depends on whether or not the guy succeeds in doing whatever it is he has to do, right? Um, or maybe even the, the fate of the whole world, you know? Um, so the stakes are as high as you can make them, right? And, um, and the, you know, um, so you, you have an exotic location, the stakes are ramped up to the max. Um, 
you uh, you got to make the the characters people that you although that uh, sorry although things are ramped up to the max you've got to be able to manage that too because you can't have things ramped up to the max for the whole time so you've got to have waves troughs and crests and troughs of action and intensity right um, and then you of course you've got to make the reader care about the the character uh, right and there's various ways in which you do that right um so um and then you know the the, the, the other thing that um, that follow, that um, Zuckerman says is that you know you do outlines you know and you 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 set out your story and you try and as in an out, in outline form you try and, and you go over the outline again and again and again until you make it as compelling as you can make it right um, and then finally you, you 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 then go and write the novel which is actually you know when you've got a really compelling um, you know basically plan uh, uh, you then go and implement the plan it's like a pre-production uh, work on a movie you know like it's a pile of work done in a movie before anyone touches a camera in the same way pile of work done on a novel before you start writing any scene in the, in the in the way of a novel in the, in the way of writing a novel um so um and the, the reason i mention that is that because um um the, um george martin's books fit into this um into this into this formula perfectly like you know every chapter is like 10 pages long there's two pieces of action in every chapter you know the story moves along relentlessly and you know and that that kind of two pieces of action you know there's something happens every four or five pages you know that's like a zombie and it gives the novel terrific pace and it moves along like you 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 know you read seven or eight hundred pages of a novel you know and you can't wait you know it's got a terrific sort of momentum and so it, it it really works, and as I say, that everything that um, Zuckerman says to do, um, um, uh, George Martin does in these books. You know, it's a fine example of how to write for blockbusters. You know, anyway. So that's my little video on Game of Thrones. So uh, which is, as I say, on this week, and this. Uh, so I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. As you can see, I'm really already watching videos. You know, Game of fucking Thrones. Game of fucking Thrones. <laughs> Yeah, game of thrones, 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 game of thrones